AI, and Social Security. Will this impact current and future checks? That's a great topic and exactly what I want to focus on for you right here in the video. So let's get right into it. I know in this video, I do want to give some attention to AI, otherwise known as artificial intelligence, and how it relates to Social Security. I just got done reading a number of different reports and articles written exactly about this, and we are going through a massive, massive shift right now, which is ultimately going to impact the United States economy as well as the global economy and believe it or not it's also going to impact social security in a major way as well this is something that is very important and it is something that is happening right here and now therefore we need to focus on this and give some attention to this this is a very important topic therefore let's get into it and talk about what's going on what they're saying about this and the impacts to social security current benefits as well as future benefits as well let's get into it and talk through all the details really fast before we do thanks so much for joining me. If you haven't done so yet, or if you happen to be new here, please make sure to hit that subscribe button right down below the video. The big old button waiting for you down there. Make sure to hit that if you have not done so yet. It's totally free to do so, and I'm here for you right by your side every single day to help you out in any way that I possibly can by bringing you the latest updates, doing all the research that you don't need to, and bringing it to you in these short videos, which, which I deliver a couple times each and every day. Things are happening very fast right now. It is a very busy time, and we know that a lot of changes are happening as well. So again, thanks for being here. I truly do appreciate your support. Please subscribe down below if you haven't done so yet. And let's get into it and talk about AI, social security, what's going on here, what is being written about this, what are people saying, and how this is going to impact things in a major, major way. And like I said a minute ago, we're going through some massive shifts right now. And a lot of it has to do with this whole AI thing. Now, what's interesting about this is maybe six months ago, nine months ago, a year ago, AI was not even that much of a big deal, right? We didn't hear much about it at all. Now we hear a ton about this stuff. It's all of a sudden like one day, it's like it came out of nowhere, right? Well, it kind of did. You know, obviously it's been around for a while, but it wasn't really getting a whole lot of mainstream uh, focus and attention up until not that long ago, right? And now it's like a big deal and it is all over the place. So again, when I say AI, artificial intelligence, okay, let me explain this really quickly because you might not even know, like, what do you even mean by that? Basically, robotics or, like, sophisticated computers taking over and doing things that humans could do, okay? There's a lot of different applications for this. But just understand it kind of that on that basic level. You don't really need to know a whole lot more about it. If you want, I can certainly talk about it in a different video, but that is honestly a whole topic in and of itself. Honestly, it's actually probably a series of videos. There's a lot of information there, but just think of it this way. Automation, robots, sophisticated computers that are basically taking over humans. That's basically what's happening, okay? So yeah, you can see here, right? The taking over of machines or whatever. It's literally what it is, okay? All right, so anyway, with that being said, let me share with you some of the details I was literally just reading about right before filming this video. I was reading about all this and I thought, you know what, this is really good stuff. I've got to share this in a video here. This is something that's happening. So here's what they're suggesting about this. Because of AI taking over, I continue to see articles suggesting within the next 15 to 20 years, and again, I know it's a very long time, but within the next 15 to 20 years, they're suggesting AI could replace 80% of the workforce in the United States. That is crazy to think about, right? Which, by the way, right now in the United States, there's a little over 180 million people in the workforce, okay? The population is about 334 million people and 180 plus million people are in the workforce, okay? 80% of that being replaced would be a huge, huge deal and replaced by robotics, essentially, right? Computers, um, you know, things like that. Machines, essentially, okay? All right, so... But that's in the next 15 to 20 years. But they're also saying, suggesting in the next five to seven years, like 27% of the of the workforce could be replaced by AI. Again, another huge percentage in not that many years from right now, right? But here's one thing that they really focused on. Okay, remember this much. How does Social Security get money? They get money through payroll taxes, right? So here's what happens. Somebody goes out and they get a job, a, you know, a traditional nine to five job, or maybe somebody is self-employed. doesn't really matter. Income is income, right? But here's what happens. From a traditional standpoint, when you go out and you spend your time, you know, working a salary job or an hourly job or something like that, you get paid before you get any, uh, any money, before you even see a penny of the money that you've earned they take out taxes, federal, state, FICA. You've probably seen that on your uh, pay stub before, right? 
So what happens is you pay 6.2% as the employee, you pay 6.2%, the employer pays 6.2% on your behalf. A total of 12.4% taxes go to Social Security, right? If you're self-employed, you get the luxury of paying all of it, all 12.4% to Social Security, okay? Now, obviously, as well, Medicare taxes are in there as well. But my point is, this is where the money comes from. This is where the vast majority of money from Social Security Trust Fund actually appears, okay? This is where they get the money that they pay out to beneficiaries. Okay, now let's think for a minute. If 27% of the population in the next five to seven years, and potentially 80% of the population in the next, say, 15 to 20 years is replaced by machines, robotics, AI, whatever, things like this that are replacing the jobs of humans, who's paying that payroll tax? Are you going to tax a robot? Well, they're thinking about it, okay? But as of right now, there's nothing like that in place, okay? So as they start to see all these jobs replaced out there because of AI and this artificial intelligence and you know very sophisticated computers and machines and algorithms and stuff like that, taking over the jobs of humans, there's nobody out there paying that social security tax, okay? As a result of that, the trust fund is becoming less and less, as in less money is coming in, more and more money is going out to beneficiaries. You see how this is working, right? I don't need to explain this very uh, very much. You know exactly the picture that I'm painting right now. It's uh, not necessarily a good one, right? So here's what they're now talking about. And again, nothing like this has been passed yet. AI is still so brand new right now that they have not passed any legislation about this. But there's talk out there about potentially implementing a tax on robots, okay? Like a tax on uh, productivity. Now, there's also things like that. They've talked about potentially taxing any new uh, technology or AI, anything, anything that is bought by a business uh, to be implemented to replace the jobs of humans. Anything that would potentially replace human jobs potentially has a tax associated with it. But my big question would be, okay, fine, they tax them, which we know they're going to do because that's what they love to do. They love taxing everything. So we know that they're gonna do this. But my question would be, okay, fine. Maybe they implement a federal and a state tax. Is there a social security tax implemented in there as well? I don't know about that, okay? You, know, you always hear these things about, oh, we're gonna implement all these taxes and stuff like that. Okay, fine. But is there a tax for social security in there as well? If not, then how is Social Security get, get their money? You know what I'm saying here? So again, a very complex topic right now, and they got to figure this thing out because this AI storm is coming quick here. It's already here right now, and we already know for a fact AI has already replaced jobs, not only here in the United States, but globally as well. It is already a thing. It has already replaced a lot of jobs. Not a huge percentage on a percentage basis of total jobs out there, but it's already starting, okay? We know this. Now, again, an example that I've given you before in other videos is think of fast food joints for a second, okay? Fast food restaurant, okay? I don't know how many people work in a fast food restaurant at any given time. I honestly don't know, okay? But I'm guessing it's probably, I don't know, maybe eight or 10 people at any given time are probably working within there, you know, with all the different positions and stuff like that. But there are automated fast food restaurants out in the country right now in a few different locations around the country, a couple different states out there already have fully automated, not a single human within the place. Robotic arm flips the burgers, robotic arm films, uh, fills the bags, robotic tray pushes the food out to the person. You know what I'm saying? It's all automated. You can have one person overseeing maybe like five or six stores remotely. You know what I'm saying here? This is a major thing. And again, this is just fast food. But I'm just saying, think of all the other things out there right now. Even warehouses, for example, I've talked about this before in other, in other videos. Warehouses completely run by robots, okay? Robots on their little machines or their little wheels, they drive around, they, they pull the, the items off the shelves, they package them, slap the label on it, and they bring it to the dock for, you know, for shipment. Again, this is happening, this is real stuff, okay? And again, this is just some applications. Think about all the other things out there like, I don't know, there's so many jobs out there, honestly, I don't even know what, what everything is out there, but there's so many different things out there that could be completely 100% automated by a computer. Meanwhile, we have a human doing all this stuff right now, and they might you know, look at this and think, hey, why are we having a human sitting here doing this for eight hours a day, five days a week? We could have a robot do the same thing, you know, AI, um, you know, sophisticated computers, machines. We could have computers do the same thing fractions of the time, like almost instantly practically, and we don't have to have somebody sitting here all day entering all this stuff in, right? Again, weird, weird shift that we are going through. It's happening. There's nothing we can do about it, and uh, this is what's happening. So 
Anyway, I was reading about this just literally minutes ago before I started filming this video and I thought I gotta talk about this because this is a major thing right now and this is going to impact uh, people in a major way, okay? So as of right now, nope, we don't really need to worry about things as of yet, but if we fast forward in say 12 months from right now and if we fast forward in a year, in one year, I guarantee you, this landscape is going to be very different. The story that we're talking about now is going to be like dramatically different in one year from right now. I'm very curious to see what happens, okay? This is a big thing. We've got to keep an eye on this. I know I say that a lot in other videos, like, oh, bills and packages, oh, let's keep an eye on it. Yeah, we'll keep an eye on those as well, but this is something we really, really need to keep an eye on, okay? Very important. Anyway, hope this helps you. Again, I know it's kind of confusing, but leave your comments, your questions, your feedback down below. If you want me to come back in another dedicated video and talk about this further and elaborate more, I'd certainly be able to do that for you. Let me know what you want me to explain. I can certainly do that. Whatever you want, just let me know. Um, it's fascinating to see this happening, right? So anyway... I just want to bring this to your attention. It's like weird, right? <laughs> this is the new world we're living in right now. So it's not going anywhere. In fact, in fact, it's only going to get uh, more, what, uh, machine related or I don't even know what I'm trying to say. It's just, it's going to be more of this, okay? Humans are going to be uh, consistently more and more replaced, okay? Yeah, this is the reality. Anyway, hope this helps you. Again, I'm here for you in any way that it can be. Please make sure to subscribe down below if you haven't done so yet. Share the video with your friends, family, social media. And go back and check out any of the other 4,000 videos here on the channel. Enjoy your day. Take care. Have a good one and catch you again later in the next